I'm just gonna tell you right now, I already wore this bag religiously. Am I recording? I clearly just moved into my new apartment. Excuse the mess in the background if you see it because I guess I have other priorities right now. But let's do an unboxing! If you don't want to hear me talk, feel free to fast forward right here. But if you want to stick around, hang out, put me as a background music because I think I have a soothing voice. And you just want to hear me talk because you're feeling lonely or something like that, then stick around. I actually clickbait you, but I didn't mention which bum bag it is, okay? This is probably one of my best purchases so far. I'm just gonna tell you right now, I already wore this bag religiously. When I tell you religiously, religiously, no matter where I went, I wore it every single day. This bag is actually my move in bag i just wanted like a new bag for a new apartment previous apartment i stayed there for about like two years if you wanted to know where i was comment below i will let you know because the backyard of the previous apartment i i was in is the space needle you're not gonna expect what this is okay this is i hope i'm saying the bag's name correctly if i don't then don't scream at me don't yell at me but feel free to correct me and if you hear snoring it's my pug the louis vuitton bag. monogram Bum bag. <laughs> Even the bachetta leather is so like very beautiful. The honey patina is honey patinaing. Okay, this is the story time on how I got this. The very first time I saw this was back in 2019 or two between 2019 and 2020. Basically, I think this is my very first Louis Vuitton bag that I really like but I didn't get a chance to buy it because I was saving money to buy my dream truck and by the time I wanted to get this I was basically you know don't have money left and then I eventually decided not to buy it because I heard that the over here it cracks right it cracks and that's a proven fact that the canvas cracks and i was like oh i guess it was not meant to be now a few years later here in 2024 listen i have never seen this bag in person only online believe it or not i've only seen this bag online i swear to god when i saw this bag someone was wearing it around space needle when i was walking and i was like <gasps> i have never been so shook in my life i was like oh my god it was actually nice so this person was actually wearing it like this i'm wearing my pajamas okay leave me alone this person was wearing it like this like that and i was like i need to have one i want one now i was so scared to buy it because you know how it's like the cracking basically it was the cracking i decided i was like no i'm not gonna buy it because it cracks and i told myself you literally only live once so why just not buy the bag so i ended up Part two of this story, I was looking for this bag. I followed this page on Facebook. It's called the Louis Vuitton Gold Mine. I love that group. I suggest joining because people there are very kind. One of the persons at that group, they know how to paint. And I actually got this luggage tag from eBay. And look, I got my pug painted. This is Chicharona. And it's very cute. Honestly, I think it's super cute. And you can hang it to your bag. Period. There are a bunch of Louis Vuitton bum bags there. There's actually one that is... There's this one seller. Her name is Lena, I believe. The last time I saw is she has three of them and they're still like looking new. I, I was gonna buy one from her, but for the price, I understand that it's like three grand, but I was like, eh, I really hate the, the Vachetta leather since it's like super white. So I decided to like go on that Facebook page and I also went to eBay. Now here we go. I, I went on eBay and I saw this bag. I was like, oh my god, the bag is perfect. Like the honey patina is perfect. Everything was perfect. There's no cracks. And that's all I was paying attention to. And I'm like, wow, the canvas is like super nice looking too. I saw the seller. The seller didn't have nothing on it. Like the seller is basically like new. They probably had like two items sold and I was very skeptical. So I messaged her. So sis, if you're watching this, I love you so much. I told her like, 
hey, is this authentic? And you know what she said? You know what she said? And she was like, it's actually microchip. And I'm like, oh my God. I totally forgot that these bags come microchip. I was so flabbergasted. I was like, no way, they came microchip. So I don't know when this was actually discontinued, but this one is actually microchip, okay? Yes, I scanned it, it worked. When did they discontinue this? Was it March 2021 or March 2022? But my theory is this bag has been microchip in the beginning of 2021, which is January. So January 2021, so which means this bag is only three years old. So it's practically new still. Am I crazy? Didn't they announce the microchip of Louis Vuitton? in 2021 somebody correct me okay i fell in love with it because that like puts my mind to ease that it's authentic i asked her like a couple of questions like if there's anything wrong with the bag and she said no but there is a storage smell like because she hasn't worn this bag she basically just like had it sitting up in the on top of her closet and she said when she stored the bag she stored it like this you know how everybody has a problem with this piece right here canvas softened enough that this is like easily like going like that I got this um, charcoal. So far this thing, it's working. It's taking out that storage smell. Going back to the story, she was scared because like obviously it's online. So she was so scared that someone would scam her. As soon as I was ready to check out, so what I did, I was like, give me your sale. I'll send you money right now. As soon as I sent that $2,500, she sent me like $300 back. So I got this for $2,200. Good price, microchip, honey patina. No cracks. On top of that, no, this is not the box it comes with, but she gave it to me for free. So girl, if you're watching this, I just want to say thank you so much. If you plan to purchase one of these, do it as soon as possible with a good price. Do it as soon as possible. Out of all the Louis Vuitton bags I have, this is probably the most worn so far. Only con that I see is minor dirt, but it's not bad at all. Can you... Can you tell or no? But there is like little, this is where she probably had the, this buckle right here. This is probably where she had it. But after receiving this bag, I adjusted it all the way down here. And the gold is still beautiful. And the glazing, I see like minor cracks on the glazing, but it, it's not too bad at all. And the canvas color, it matches one of my bags. Hold on. So, I don't know if you can tell, but this is it's still for sale, by the way. It's on my Macari, link below. Pretty much the same looking. I think I might get another one. I'm really not sure, but I might. Because I just love this. I'm being delusional, but if Louis Vuitton is potentially watching this, if you plan to redesign this bag, I suggest cut off the part where the bag is cracking. Cut it off right there. I like the shape of this. But if anything, I would make canvas from where it cracks full bachetta leather. I don't know if you get the vision, but feel free to take the idea, okay? If you want to subscribe, like, or comment, feel free to do so. But it's not really unnecessary. But if you want to, then that's great. And to whoever is watching this, I hope we became digital friends. I guess I will see you on my next video. Feel free to follow my social media. And stay safe out there, okay? I'll see you later. Bye!